And we begin with breaking news. The Supreme Court halting the execution of Richard Glossop. This emergency hold on his execution will stay in place while the justices take a look at the case. It's the latest development in an ongoing legal tug of war for the man convicted of killing his boss, Barry Van Trees, back in 1997. News 4's Ashley Moss joins us now with details. Ashley. The Supreme Court blocked Oklahoma from executing death row inmate Richard Glossop after the state's attorney general, Gettner Drummond, agreed Glossop's life should be spared. He said Glossop did not get a fair trial. Glossop has spent the last 26 years behind bars and has faced nine execution dates. An Oklahoma appeals court subsequently upheld Glossop's conviction and the state's pardon and parole board deadlocked in a vote to grant him clemency. As we said, the high court put that execution on hold while it reviews the case. Earlier this week, Glossop's attorney asked the Oklahoma County District Court to throw out a recent hearing where the pardon and parole board voted to deny clemency. We are monitoring reaction coming in on the state of execution. Attorney General Drummond releasing this statement this afternoon saying, I am very grateful to the U.S. Supreme Court for their decision to grant a stay of execution. I will continue working to ensure justice prevails in this important case. And Richard Glossop's attorney Don Knight says he's grateful to the Supreme Court and says in part, there is nothing more harrowing than the thought of executing a man who the state now admits has never received a fair trial. Look out for more on this story throughout the afternoon and the evening. In the newsroom, Ashley Moss, Oklahoma's News 4.